Hi. Welcome to my video. Um, but I was just watching Emma Chamberlain's video and it really inspired me to start making videos because I've been wanting to do videos for years now and I'm literally the only one that stops myself from doing that. And I was watching her waking up at 5 a.m. video, which I've done before, but like I never really vlogged it or anything. Um, but I know that it does make you feel really good. But I was like, oh, maybe I should do that video. But what do I do? Like, I have nothing to do. I might try it tomorrow. I don't know. But I like, ha what do I do? Like, even right now, I wake up at, like, 7, which is not that early to me. I wake up at, like, 7, and then I make my bed, and then go eat, have some breakfast, and then go throughout my day and just meditate and do yoga, and then I do tarot readings on TikTok. But all of that, like, in my head, it's like, why would anyone want to watch that? But it's... But really, I feel like realistically, it's like a lot of people would want to watch that. You know what I mean? So it's like I'm the only one stopping myself. Anyways, I thought I'd bring you along my day and what I do today. And yeah. So here we go. Maybe I'll wake up at 5 a.m. tomorrow. I don't know. Okay, so I was watching YouTube videos right now, which I haven't done in a while. Love my voice crack. I haven't done it in a while. But, I'm tired of being on my phone, and for the past couple of days, I have been on my phone a lot, because I've been doing, like, tarot readings and just posting a lot of content on TikTok. Um, but I want to do some yoga right now, and a meditation, so, let's do some yoga. I'm literally soaking. When I tell you guys, yoga literally gets my sweat going y'all i don't even sweat this much going on a hike but when you do yoga i think because it works out like your whole body um yeah anyways i'm about to do some meditation and the yoga that i did was yoga with adrian um she's literally amazing i literally recommend her even if you've never done yoga she's amazing um, but I'm gonna do some yoga now. I mean, some meditation. Okay, I just finished doing my meditation. Please don't fall. Before I get into the shower, I'm gonna do a armpit mask. Armpit mask with me. Um, I was listening to a heart chakra meditation. Oh, let me feed my cat. So I'm also going to do, I um, made some rice yesterday and I'm going to wash my hair with rice water. Basically the water that you clean the rice with, I guess. Because since I dyed my hair, <sighs> it's so dry. It's, it's just not the best. And this was the first time dyeing it, so... Um, I like bleached it and have dyed it like multiple times now just to re-get the purple and the blue that I had over here. Um, but I just want to really hydrate my hair and yeah, so we're going to do that. I don't know how to do this because, let me get the push. I think what I'm going to do is wait for my hair to grow longer up to like my back. And then a dye the ends green because since the ends are already damaged and already like uh, like white, literally white, um, it'd be easier just to dye it than cutting it off and then bleaching the ends and dyeing it green. You know what I mean? So yeah, but anyways, right now we're just going to put some rice water in my head, in my hair. I don't even know how you do this, to be honest. So I'm probably doing it wrong, but that's okay. Okay, we're just going to dump it on my hair i guess i don't have that much but ah 
I, I knew that was gonna happen. It smells so weird. It smells like, it smells like water, but like weird. It smells like water and rice. Now we're gonna do this um, armpit mask because I've been trying to not use deodorant because deodorant literally has so many bad things in it. <laughs> and probably what I'm using is not the best either. But my grandma uses this. So, and she's she's never used deodorant, but this is what she does so she can keep her armpits clean. Um I'm actually going to get I'm going to get a bowl. <laughs> I got a bowl and I'm gonna put some baking soda in here okay and then you get your lemon which I'm gonna cut okay so don't use scissors to cut a lemon it's gonna look like this it's kind of messy to be honest and the rice water is literally falling everywhere but it looks like this, and then we're just gonna. Okay, I'm gonna do this, and then I'll come back. Okay, so I just finished putting it on my armpits. Now I'm gonna wait for it to dry, and then I'm gonna get in the shower. just got out the shower and now I'm gonna get ready so I can do some material videos on TikTok so let's get ready uh, I'm gonna I'm just gonna curl my lashes because I don't even have anything I'm just gonna curl my lashes and I'm not asking for too much I'm asking the wrong mother ever. There's literally a mirror over here. I don't know why I'm doing it on the camera, but that's okay. <laughs> okay. Hi. And now I'm gonna put some mascara that's years old. And I want to put it just on the ends. Vaseline. Today's really a calm day. Like, there's not a lot going on outside. I mean, there's a lot, but like, from my window. Um. I don't know if anyone else has been like this, but I just really been like my own, like not really wanting to be with people and just. Hey guys, there's my cat. This is my shirt that I'm talking about, and these are the pants. I mean shorts. Anyways, I'm gonna be doing some tarot readings now, and then probably chill later. And that's it. I want to pull a tarot card before we end this video. I really want to start posting more stuff like this. Um, well, I'm going to start posting more stuff like this too. And I was thinking about how like, well, in my, within my YouTube channel, I post um i started do i started this like series where i share a piece of my journal like i journal every week and then every week like i share something with you guys um but i was thinking if i continue doing this like just regular daily vlogs um i can just include that in the vlog so yeah this is the first card that i pulled out the ten of cups love that for you the tower card 
the sun and then the six of swords period if that resonates with you um as you should um six of cups i mean six of swords means like you're leaving like a situation a toxic situation just something that no longer serves you really releasing it and like being like see you later not even see you later like see you never because i i left the door open and now it's closing um so yeah this means like you're leaving a situation they're literally pack their shit and go and then this is a tower moment which is like goes in hand with the six of swords where it's like you um things may feel a little like out of place right now but it's out of place because it's moving you into a transition period well you're like in a transition period where you're going into where you're meant to be type thing so or just like a better version of yourself or your living situation whatever whatever however this resonates with you it's like you like releasing that and letting go and like they're literally jumping out of a burning building so well my nose itchy so it's like um say this is like the building is like your emotions and if you don't know how to handle emotion like this is you like letting go of the it's like you letting go of that guard of like not wanting to face your emotions so yeah and then you got the sun which the sun always rises that's something that i've been hearing so much lately the sun always rises regardless of where you're at where you're at mentally emotionally physically wherever the sun always rises with you even when it's cloudy the sun always rises so if that resonates with you that resonates with you also he's kind of like a baby um I don't even know if I can show that, but he's kind of like a baby, so it's like a rebirth. I don't know why that just like came in. And then Ten of Cups, it's like all you, your abundance, a partnership, your kids, your house, your whole mansion in the back, your land, all the things you've accomplished in life, and just like happiness and prosperity overall. So, yeah. Oh, my nose is so itchy. Um, when I was growing up, they told me that whenever your nose is itchy is because you're getting, like, a psychic download, which always makes sense because a lot of times that happens to me. Um, but anyways, yeah, this is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you're having a good day. And, yeah, remember to take time for yourself and just rest and do some self-care stuff if that's something you feel up to doing um if not and this is a busy day for you um i hope i was able to bring down the stress of your day um anything that you might have carried throughout the day any worries um i hope this helps and i hope you guys had fun watching this anyways bye see you next week